Okay, so yeah, we were just discussing the fact you want to put maybe your whole face in instead of just your uh, eyeball. Um, we, were, <laughs> we were discussing the fact that um, ew, I it was so weird because my shirt was down and my head would look so small because my black shirt was blended in with the background. My head looked like Beetlejuice's head. <laughs> it was like this big. But um, we were discussing the fact that Hannah has a gun. Um, really, after all these girls have been through, you're why gonna, would he? You... I mean, he did a fucking he did a cartwheel on the ledge of the fucking <laughs> on the ledge of the building and then flipped them the bird before he left. Like, yeah, I pretty mean, much. he had enough had time. time to take a selfie. He yeah, was like, he was he was there. He was like, selfie, hey, hey! Look, at, look at the girls, <laughs> yeah, I'm just shot at throw, yeah. Really, yeah. <laughs> like, I mean, it. it, it uh, uh, really, really, it was not a quick getaway at all. No, um, it was actually like he seriously he had time went, to recreate the Mona yeah. Lisa. Like it, it, it made no sense. And they just watched him. They were like, oh, "There he goes. What are we gonna do? Hey, what are we gonna do? I have a gun in my hand. I have a gun. gun. What are we Stop, gonna do? Stop! Take off your mask. Go. Oh, he's gone. Come on. Take off your mask. Come on. Mask. That like, was the dumbest thing I've that ever was... seen in my life cheesiest pretty little moments liars boom right there worst freaking moment on the history of the show moments that make you want to jump in the fucking show and start punching people i mean seriously like it's like a horror movie it's like one of those bad horror movies where they're freaking they they caught they're uh, running know, and they trip not even they they're running and they trip they freaking got on a train four and a half hours later and michael myers is waiting for them at the next train stop like yeah. I, that's what it was it was like just the dumbest <laughs> I don't shit i think i've ever seen that all week <laughs> <laughs> it was just the dumbest <laughs> shit ever the dumbest shit ever like, all aboard <laughs> seriously it was just dumb to me that was dumb dumb da dumb 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 da dumb 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 like, I mean, Hannah, honestly, like, you think that you would know better. Like, out of all the girls that I figured having the most strength being able to do something like that, like, you don't have to shoot them in the head. You shoot them to freaking, uh, you know what I Maim mean? Maim them. Yeah. Like, you're so shooting So that they can't to, run into the distance and start Shoot them start in the foot. Shoot them, shoot them in the leg. Shoot them in the arm. Shoot them in the dick. Or vagina, depending on which gender. Or both. Yeah. Lucas. Anyway, no, not that I think that Lucas is fucking a. Because she, she calls him Hermie. Okay. Yeah, but anyway. Anyway, so that was just. I mean, that to me was. We were both like, shoot him, shoot him. Sh what are you doing? Shoot him! Like I thought I for mean, sure. Honestly, like, that was the first. Like that was the first season finale we haven't had a reveal, right? It wasn't. It wasn't right. It was just because, like, even last season finale with the, the well, no, because fire. season one finale there was no reveal because that's when Ian was blasted off the bell tower. Okay, but like, um, but season two was Mona. Season but that was the finale though. The, the first yeah. one, the one with Ian off the bell tower, wasn't that the? That was season one finale. Was that the finale or was that the mm -hmm. mid season? No, finale? that was the finale. That was in March. Oh, okay. And then, what was season two mid season finale? I don't remember. Mm -hmm. I don't remember the mid-season finale. I remember I know Mona, Mona, Mona season finale. And then season three, the mid-season mid finale was Toby. That was mid-season. Right. And then, and then the last, well, the, season... The barn was right. that, and then this was the mid-season, right? Mm -hmm. Well, no, this was the season finale. Was it? I thought it was the mid-season. No. I'm so confused. We're there's so many fucking seasons. Like, I don't, I don't know. We're going I don't know. into season I feel five. like we're watching Friends, okay? Like, there's like 27 seasons, and it's just never ending. No, this is going to be season five, episode one is going to be a continuation of season four. Of th that night. Yes. It starts immediately as Rosas is on the fucking ground. He's bleeding. <laughs> well, they said that the season five, uh, season five uh, premiere is supposed to be just as good. As Does this work? No, I don't think no. so either. Just as good and suspenseful. Does that work? Not really. It's supposed to be just as good and suspenseful as the season finale. It's supposed to be just like well, that, the season finale. That's what I'm saying. Uh, which, if it's anything like the season finale, I'm not going to enjoy it. Well, hopefully there's more to it. 
Like what? They're going to catch up with this motherfucker? That That's highly doubtful. Or Noel's going to tackle someone and be like, I caught him. And then they're going to punch Noel in the groin and they're going to get away. I, I, I don't. I don't see where Noel plays into this. Like, that was just a... That had to have been a That didn't or even make any sense. I know. Like, She's I mean, like, I of course... Some, well, I, you know, we all have That'll be explained in the season nine premiere, but... Yeah. I, I just... I, I just don't Who understand. else is just like, okay, I I know, we all love the show, but who else is just ready for it to be done? From what I heard, there in season six, there's only going to be 12 or 13 episodes. That's so far, though. Well, They have it so that they can end it like that, but they're trying to sign on for a season seven. They want to get to season seven. That is what, that is words out of Marlene King's tweets. That's what you want to say. She wants to get to seven. She is saying that they have enough material to get them to seven. Which, I mean, enough material to get you to seven. I, <clears throat> I want it to end at six. Because I feel like if they end it at six, season six will be jam-packed with information. And it'll just be the greatest season. That's what I feel. I feel if they do end it early, if they drag it on to season seven, then it's going to be a lot of the same shit, just filler episodes and, like, boring and, like... Okay, Whereas the if point. they actually do the season six with those 13 episodes... It'll be I'm going to compare it... Again, I'm going to compare it to One Tree Hill. Season nine of One Tree Hill, for those everything of you who've watched the show, episode. was fucking amazing. Because every episode... Every episode, there was, was something that happened, that happened, that happened, that happened. Yeah. It's, where they ended it with a bang. It's not going to be, like, that's what I'm saying. If they if they take it to seven, it's just going to be dragged on, and it's just going to be, I mean, we'll get the same information, but it'll just be dragged on, and it won't feel like it's amazing. You know what I mean? Whereas if they do it and end it in season six, they're going to have all that information that they would have put into season seven. It's going to be jam-packed into season six in just a couple episodes, and it's just going to be the greatest season ever. So I think that they should end it at six. I absolutely think so. And give us a little so. bit of, you now, know what I mean? For those of you out there who've seen that thing that was posted, what are your thoughts on if there would be a movie, Megan? Ooh, I would love that. I would totally be there. An hour and a half and it's over? Oh, I'm there. Absolutely. I'm there, but I don't think, I think that they should definitely do it from like A's point of view. Like from the A-team's point of view. Show us how they did what they did. Why they did what they did. Because like, I mean, even though we're going to know those answers in episodes, I'd like to see things in like like further into it and like more in depth you know what I mean like I'd rather see things from their point of view than the girls we've seen enough of the girls I'm ready to see some A-team action um how they did necessary because they're never going to be able to fit everything in like I'm talking about the small stuff like how why would they trap you know her in the shower how did they do it how did they get in their houses how did they you know what I mean like I want to know small just details. yeah small details that were never touched upon that yeah they're never going to be anything. touched upon that will never be touched upon. Such as Spencer being locked in the bathroom? Or the snake being put into the room so Anything, her, like... anything that happened. They never asked Mona, Mona, what did you hell, do exactly? How about going back to that creepy little fucker in the doll shop? How the hell and who the hell that's did he talk That's what I'm saying. To? I want to know. I want a movie that's going to explain all this shit. And I don't want to wait five years for it. Like, I want it as soon as the seasons are over. I want it. And I, I don't... I. I wouldn't be as interested in it as if it was just a movie based on the series. Like, you know what I mean? I would go see it, of course, but I just wouldn't be that interested to go see the same shit that we already know. You know right. what I mean? Like, I don't know. Because what else would they bring about in a movie if they end it with season six? So maybe that is the route that they're going to take is going from A's point of view. I if would they had, so. If they had intelligence. That would be the route that they're taking. Well, yeah, I mean, you can't, I mean, you can't just leave people guessing, like, how they did shit. And, like, no. this is not the X-Files, okay? I'm sorry, but Yo, that was this a is great not fucking open show. for discussion. Like, well, they could have done this or they could have done that. Like, no, I want answers, okay? I have this much time invested in it. I'm going to have another three years invested in it. I want some fucking answers. God, three more years. Two and a half. Now, that's if they go to season seven. If yeah, they don't so go to season seven, then we it's have a year, a year and a half, half. right? That's going to suck. So, it's still going to suck a year and a half. I mean, it, uh, 
I, I really, I, I don't know how much more I can take of this shit. Like, I really Actually, don't. Actually, no. It'd be two years more Almost because... two years, yeah. Because it had ended March. Yeah. So, more, two more years. Definitely two more years. At least. So... How would they do that, though? If it really is 13 episodes, do you think that they would have it just be the summer? Well, if it's only 13 episodes, I don't, I don't know. Then I would say that they'd only have it as the summer. Maybe, yeah. But I don't, I don't know what they're going to do, but I'm really upset because... It's going to be bittersweet, the series finale of Pretty Little Liars. It, it, I, no, I think it's just going to be sweet. Well, yeah, but bittersweet because it's, we love the show. We do. We, we, we love have, the show. We would have, like, nothing to watch on Tuesdays. But at the same time, it'd be like, thank God we finally have answers. I just don't. I, I feel like every time that we see the show for a season finale, we're just disappointed about everything. And I just feel well, like. Well, except for season three finale where Toby and Spencer we were happy with that. we were happy with that we were happy when Toby and Spencer but I'm talking about 18 reveals oh, I and know. you know except for Toby's reveal because well we... Toby's reveal but we were disappointed about that we didn't want Toby to be on the no. 18 but I'm just saying like everything that we found out so far we were just disappointed with and like I know that that's very cynical and like a lot of people out there are like you know why are you guys so negative blah 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 but I just I expect so much more from this show and I just feel like every time that they're supposed to deliver they don't and it's not that we're don't. being negative it's an opinion on a show that we all enjoy yeah if you could do it better make your own youtube channel up and then try to construe what you have to say about it i mean i just feel like they could just do they could just shock us so much more and just pull people out of the woodworks and just use those people to be on the ATM such and as? just give them like instead of using like i mean seriously because even if mona was not in the books we never read the books, and I mean, yeah, we knew Mona was mo uh, like a in the books, but yeah, even because of all the people that would be like, oh my god, it was not. In the but books. even it so, even if Mona was not a in the books, she was somebody that I would have suspected from day one. Well, yeah, you know what I mean. Same thing with Toby. Toby, I think Toby out Toby of died anyone, in the books. I, I mean, Toby out of anybody, I would have suspected. Um, so, I mean, the only thing that is keeping me like okay positive is the fact that maybe in fact they are going to use Ren as oh, Big Oh, they a. better because they, they oh, we're don't hoping get for me that. Started. That would be like my number one thing is if Ren is Big A because I want to know he there's so many things that lead to him um secretly lead to him, you know what I mean? Like under the uh, under under yeah, the like radar lead to him. And I feel like he would be an awesome reveal. Like, somebody that we would never suspect. Like, I mean, they could use so many people. And I'm not talking Noel or Melissa. Like, these are all people that we suspect. I'm talking about one of the fucking girls being A. Like, I'm Aria. talking about, like, something that's going to blow us away. You know, us Hannah away. would blow me the fuck away. Yeah, even Arya would blow me away. Even well, yes. though we've been talking about her being A Absolutely. since the beginning, that she would, would blow me still... Away. It would be like, holy shit. Like, I did not see that coming even though I saw it coming. You know what I mean? But, like, like Ren, for instance. My biggest thing is if he is big A, I would be so excited because I would want to know why. Mm -hmm. Why are you big? Like, why are you doing this? Like, mm -hmm. what... What kind of motive do you have? What did Allie do to you? And what did these girls do to you? That's my biggest thing. The only logical explanation with that is that he would be beach hottie. But who is But beach there is hottie? no way that these girls are being targeted the way they're being targeted over one girl that they hung out with. These girls did something individually to this person. And that's, I mean, that's just how it's got to be. Like, because there's no way that somebody's going after these girls for being friends with her. And theoretically, thinking about the timeline of it before this is over with, if Allie, in fact, was talking about Ren being the doctor that Emily could see. He wasn't even a doctor, then. But if she was talking about him, is it because he got her pregnant and then took care of it? Or was it about the whole birth control? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But that's Bye. it for now. Maybe we'll make another one when we get to Duncan.